Hi, how you doing there, folks? I want to comment about the article that was in yesterday's New York Post. Sunday, May 17th, it said Space Invaders pay did we squat? Well, let me explain, folks. Number one. Number one, I'm happy that this happened. Finally, common average people finally won the victory in New York against rich, greedy landlords that charge high excessive rents that should not be charged and it's capitalism gone amok. Well, what happened is during the late 70s, during the 80s, early 90s, when people were trampling each other trying to get out of New York, what happened is a lot of landlords abandoned a lot of buildings on the Lower East Side, East Village, just simply because of the rents that, that they only legally could charge. And with a lot of people leaving New York, empty apartments and everything, they empty apartments, apartments that couldn't be rented. The, a lot of landlords realized that the best thing to do when the, when the taxes came up is pretty much just abandon the buildings. You know, they just abandoned them. Okay, folks? And a lot of these landlords were swamp wards that did not take care of these buildings for years and pretty much just ripped off the cream coming from the rent and all that. And once the buildings fell in disrepair, the people, mass exodus of people leaving New York, a lot of these buildings were abandoned. Now once they were abandoned, the city took them over. Now, what the city really should have did was right away they should have auctioned these buildings off to, to get another landlord to take them over right away. They didn't do that. These buildings were going to sit empty for years upon years upon years upon years. Not doing nothing, they were just foul and just repair and eventually become structurally unsafe. You know? So what happened is, people from the street basically went into these buildings. They cut the chain off, went into these buildings, and then and then undertook, under, and undertook Maintaining these buildings, you know, did repairs like painting, you know, pay you pay utilities, get water in there, electric and all that, and you know, heat, and and if not for these people, if not for these squatters coming in, these buildings would not have even been maintained. Period. You know what I'm saying, folks. So the best thing is what happened. I call this I call this a victory for the average man. Now, possessions nine-tenths of the wall, well, the city unfairly tried to evict these people from these buildings during 1996-97 Giuliani, and that was totally unfair, totally stupid, folks. You know, you know, that was a good idea. Sell the buildings to the... Sell these buildings to get rehabilitated for a dollar. Oh. Sell these buildings to get rehabilitated for a dollar, and now they're they're rehabilitated, and back, and we're given to the to the people that have been living in them for years. I think that's that's very great that happened. It's a uh, finally, finally, it's a victory against greedy landlords in New York. And really, rent con rent stabilization walls, rent rent control walls should be much much stricter. I'll talk about that in another video.